So this is about a tutorial about how to make something like this in Rhino. Uh, 我将会在这个视频里介绍一下如何在信用里面做一个类似用于插板结构。Uh, this is first time do something like this, so my apology for the bad quality. Uh, I'm going to start to build the shape first, and then cut off the part I don't need. Uh, 我将会在这里面，这是我第一做的第一个视频，所以我先做一个外形，然后切去不需要的东西。I'm going to use this function here to build the shape. 我准备用这个功能去做它的外形。Uh, to do that, I need to draw the outline first. Uh, 为此我需要先把线外形的一个线画出来。So I start with the.、Uh, Basic line in the base. At the base, it should be a flat surface. So I use a straight line first. Ah, because the surface is flat, so I will use a straight line. Ah, because the surface is flat, so I will use a Thing is supposed to rotate、uh, based on this line here, so I need to cut away this part. Ah, because I want to make this thing turn around, so I need to cut this part away. So I need to cut away this part. 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 The first I did here. Just look at here if you don't understand what commander has just typed in. Uh, edit point on means that I show this edit point and just draw this line here, so I can control the shape of the line more more easily this way. This is about right, and I will cut ESC, so this point will be gone. And join these two lines. And now, as I talked before, use this to create a shape. First, the line needs to be rotated. <coughs> Uh, rotate based on this line here.
I'm rotate 336 degrees, so I'm start with I'm starting with two. So this is ship here. You can see it here. So delete all the lines that I draw before. I won't need it anymore. Ah. Now I'm going to do the shape that will cut out the part I don't need from this thing. So I uh, hide this part first, so I don't need to see it now for now. Uh, draw a square here. It's about fifty uh, times fifty. And use the extrude command to make it a solid box. I can't find it anyway here, I'm just going to type it in. This is a basic shape of the part I'm going to cut out. So basically I'm going to cut a lot of things like this. So I'm going to use array to duplicate this box a lot of times. So. Uh, let's see. Okay. You can see here it's kind of too many, but it's okay. I'm going to group all these so it can be added more easily. Now I'm, now I'm going to show the part and I just hide it. And move into the place I want it to be. I think it will be much easier to move this instead of that. So now, the, so now these two are in place. Use this to cut out the part I don't need.
Okay, this is going to take a while. Be patient. <coughs> Uh, depends on how good your computer is. It can take a few minutes or a lot more minutes. Uh, this is the first video I ever done before. You can tap ESC if you want to cancel it, but I'm sure it is going to turn out to be exactly what I want. So. I'll just leave it here for a few seconds and come back later. Okay, I go around and check some email and it's already done here. I don't know how much time it takes, but less than five minutes, I think. You can't exactly see it in here. I need to delete this part and then meet. Okay, you can see it now here. And there we go. It's not exactly ideal, but pretty much the idea about how to make something like that. Yep. Well, this is a picture and this is the one here. I think it's, it's growing more space here, but you get the idea. Well, thank you for watching. If you have any questions or have any you want, just leave a comment below.